to morning. Welcome to our day. Welcome to our day. did it guys we have moved everything but I think it's nearly six o'clock now we've been going at it for another three hours I can feel a slight pressure in my head now the only thing that we haven't done is the cabinet by the TV it needs like it's got stuff to send to people and put into frames so I'm not even fussed with doing that today and the desk needs straightening up a bit but everything else is complete and it looks so weird in here look like very weird and I managed to move the cabinet out there tidy that up put the last little bits away so as soon as those fed the girls I'm gonna get her to I'm like in between feeding us I want to quickly get her to record the room and take pictures whilst it's still good light I mean I know that we get good light until well we get daylight until like 9 but it starts getting a little bit duskier and I want you to see it in the same light that I filmed when it was horrific just so you can see the difference in which it makes not just because of the like the light coming in but with it being so cluttered it made it darker in here and I want it to be shown that it can brighten the room up as well just by moving some stuff around sorting things out tidying it up and it just generally looks so much nicer I really like it now so I'll pass the camera over to self. So, this is the before. Safe waved at me, that's why I waved back. And there's a telly in the cupboard. But look how much space we've got. Yes. It's gonna go in here. So we've got a whole living room worth of space. Which we didn't have before. Nah. And look how literally look how much brighter it is. We've got things up on the wall that we didn't before. We um where you can see the floor where it's kind of white bits have come up that's where our puffs were before yeah which meant that from that mark to the cabinet that was that's, all the room yeah. that we had so here that way was the puffs and the sofa and whatnot and then literally the table here. yeah that was a path that we had over there was the table over there was a cabinet and just a pile of crap. Whereas now, ta-da! Oh hey, look, still got this view. Um, good idea putting that there, by the way. Stops them from jumping in the window well, again. Well, we had the tent there, and they still jumped up over the tent. So I was just like, no point in putting the tent there again. No, the little toys, cuddly toys, bear, and cow in the tent, of course. But yeah, I'm very happy now. Yeah. Now it's just me sorting out the kitchen, isn't it? Yeah. I sorted out the cabinet side. Yeah. In there. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, I've not been able to clean mine by my wheelchair. Mm. We're getting there. Yay. Picture time.
Dixie, bring it in. I'll balance it. Bring it here. Bring it here. Good girl, Alba. Ready? Jump down a minute, Em. Jump down. Ready? Steady? Go. Go. You're glowing. Good girl. Ready? Steady. I love that she looks at pickles still. <laughs> yeah. Go. <laughs> Bloody floor. And then I'll just wait for her to get it so I can take it from her bed. Give me that bully. Oh, shit. Man. It's okay. Alba, good girl. Alba. Did you see her swiping? Yeah. Alba. I'm letting it go. No, no. Alba. I can see it glowing. Bring it here then. Good girl. Ready? Steady. Go. Oh. That was disappointing. It was a big girl. Bring it here then. Oh, thanks, Abba. Ow. Go get it. Yeah, don't mind me. Bring it here. Abba. <laughs> Mummy, it's under there. <laughs> people. Yeah, it's under there, Mum. Right there. It's there. It's there. <laughs> no, it's down there. I can see it, baby girl. It's by the wall glowing, isn't it? At least we can see it. I can see it there, Mum. I know. Look, we're both helping. Yes. Can, can I get it from this side? Can I get it from up there? It's down there, Mum. Right there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right there. Yeah, right there. <laughs> I help too. Can you see it, Mum? Your head's in the way. <laughs> <laughs> Get it out before you try getting it, you fool. It's mine. Got it, man. Yeah. Wiped it. Mummy, you might want to mind out the way. Yeah, mummy, pick anything. Can you pick up the two things that they've thrown, please? <laughs> just right, Dixie, this is your last one, okay? Last one. Mummy, you're supposed to say last go. Last go, okay. <laughs> Last go. Oh, shite. I got it, Mum. It's okay. <laughs> Yay. Yay.
cow. Go find your cow. <laughs> and this is what happens when Charlie does tidying. She now has a migraine, tablets aren't working, the pharmacy forgot to give us injections so she can't have one of those. And now she has to just lie there in the dark and try to sleep it off. Okay, so guys, the reason why you're looking at the sealem is we're going to give you a warning now that the next thing you're about to see is a bit gross. And basically, when I say that I've got a really junky chest that's really hard to get up not my chest but the stuff that's in my chest this is why this is okay this gunk's not even falling now babe mm. bearing in mind how much tapping that required just yeah. to do that moving like the whole pot and this is why I struggle coughing stuff out of my lungs. Yum. Don't you just love it? We were just having a discussion about my migraine because I've got puffy eyes again. And and it's it's not just because I'm looking down at the camera. My eyes are fuzzy as well. And I've got eye pain and I use an app called Migraine Buddy Rose, which is where you put where the, the time that it started, the time it finishes, and then you put like medication you've taken, how it, like if you know what triggered it, what were the side effects from it, anything else that might have helped, and you can add like notes and things like that. And I've had to add a new side effect from it or symptom being that I've got the eye pain which I've not had before normally I get like the pressure in my head but and like pressure behind my eye but not physically in my eye but my migraines on the left side of my head tonight and normally they're on my right left is very rare and we're thinking it's because it was caused by the physical exertion of cleaning Instead of just being my just lungs, being a reaction to your body, itself. yeah, my pots, things like that. So I don't know, but I did have a ten-day stretch, which means pink was ten days ago. Ten days ago. In some, in some ways it feels like a lot longer ago and in some ways it feels like it wasn't yeah and i'm quite confused i'm still conflicted i still don't know if i found out yesterday i told sophie that when pink was at wembley she was at, i think she was at wembley twice and on the the last night of no the first night of wembley she recorded the concert back 10 years ago nearly got to be 10 years ago not the last time she came to the UK but the time before it was a fun house tour wasn't it yeah um, she recorded then and I've got the DVD from that and I literally you know it back to front yeah, I, that was that was my first major concert I'd been to a shit ton of other concerts like in, the fi in a field with stage and stuff like that like with multiple artists but i've not been to one multinational artist and pink was the first one and then i went to jesse j and now pink again um and the dvd it just it brings back a visual from all that time even though this the videos from when she was in australia it's pretty much the exact same the same as I, I would probably get the DVD again um, of Wembley 
even though we didn't physically go to Wembley, it was pretty much the same thing. Yeah, because I mean, like, she wore slightly different outfits at some points, and some of the, like, her flying, for example, might have been a little bit different, but that's uh, that sort of thing's only really because it depends on, obviously, what the stadium's set up like. Yeah. Um, but the rest of it should be pretty much... It's the same songs. Yeah. What, the one time at Wembley, the, the one that they recorded... She did sing time after time, and she oh, done it amazingly. I feel like that would have been really nice. Oh, it was absolutely fantastic. Hello, Elba. Mm -hmm. They got their treat balls. Yeah, I when I went to go put my oxygen on, the wire hit her on the one side. Then the next, and she was just like went that way, then went that way, but like really, really quickly, freaked her out. Oops. But. Tomorrow, the sputum goes off, and that's the three done that they needed at three weeks, four weeks, and six weeks. Mommy, that's mean. She's I being like, I mean. I was waiting for you to take it, and you're just looking inside not, with your eyes. That's because I'm expecting you to get one out for me. Did it fall? Something fell. We've only got one left. Is it? You're helping give her cheese easily. Where's my mama? <laughs> so yeah, um, and we've decided that bef um, we're going to. Last hang on, one. sorry, I'm trying to get the camera set back up. Last one. We're gonna um, restart one. the antibiotics. They gave us the choice that if I coped off of them, then I didn't need to restart them. But we've had pretty much continual high temperatures and feeling rubbish so. and yeah and like we said in the vlog the other day that although i was getting high temperatures before being on the antibiotics um i was getting i was getting days of low grade fevers and no fevers whereas this has literally been a whole month of high grade fevers and it just makes you feel like shit yeah, it's been six weeks isn't it this last month, it's been oh. continual. And then the, the last time I had a low grade was the 2nd of June. So, ah, fair yeah. Indeed. So, thankfully, the living room is now done. Oop, oop. And we are in love with it. I mean, like we said, we've got the table to do and we've got the unit by the TV to do, but that wasn't... In my mind today, I wanted to get what I had done, done. And we did. Yeah. And that's what's resulted in this, because I'm stubborn. and Yeah. There was a little bit that went... When I knew that it was starting, Sophie came in and she was just like, are we done yet? I was like, nope, just got this little bit to do. And normal people would have stopped at that point, thinking, okay, is it a little bit left now? You can do it tomorrow. No. I had to get it done. Did you get my text? text. I'm asking so first. What's up? No. Hang on. Hang on. What, the link? Yeah. Why have I got to read it to the people? I want to just see your reaction. Okay. Oh, I'm nervous. There's nothing to be nervous about. So if, that, yeah, Soph's mum has been trying to send her sister pictures. I've tried sending Soph's mum pictures and I've tried uploading pictures to Instagram and it's all just failing and conking out. 
and not long ago on the news um they've announced that the server is having mm -hmm. issues between facebook instagram and whatsapp because it's the same company so that's why we're not being able to do anything Alba sat there watching Dixie like play. This. She wasn't playing until I came near her, Mum. Would you like me to put a few more in your bully? Hell bloody yeah, Mum. Yes, I do. I don't think I've seen her move that quick in a little while. So fell asleep, bless her. Obviously, because we actually have the room dark and quiet because of me. And so whilst I've been doing the living room, so it's been like plowing through the kitchen. <laughs> So I was just chatting because of like you saying earlier, have you done a lot of the kitchen? And I was like, mm, yeah, yeah, a reasonable amount. And you're like comparing to what I've done, and I was just like, no, but you shouldn't have expected it to be comparable anyway because I'm a slower person than yeah. you. Yeah, so and Soph manages to create more mess before. I don't think I did that. Tidy in. I don't think I did. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. I was actually putting things away. Oh, okay. I know. Makes a change. I know. <laughs> and you'll be really proud of me. I put away all the rubbish from doing your meds. Wow. Walked across the room and put it in again. Oh, huge achievement. I know. It's okay, it's just a motorbike. It's okay. I'm not okay. <laughs> so, I'm going to get on and take my what meds. Was you, what was you saying about before that anyway? Huh? Oh, it's about me falling asleep because it's dark. Yeah. I remember now. Yeah. Oh. It's one loud motorbike to me. Yeah. It was going quite fast up the main road. Like, it was there and then it was gone. Mm. We can see, a, like, a, a reasonable stretch of the main road in and out of Launceston. Well, in and out of Cornwall it is. And... That motorbike literally was there and then just gone within seconds. They obviously think that because Albert, it's night time and there's no one on the roads, they, they can go for it. I'm hoping that you captured that. What the? <laughs> so. Oh, some. Where's your bully? Play with your ball. But the drawer's easier. Oh, yeah. You just took that one. Right. I'm going to go take my meds. Thanks for coming on this wonderful day with us. And we shall see you tomorrow. Good night, everyone. Good night.